Welcome to the 2020 All-Star Game at Dodger Stadium. Tonight's Midsummer Showdown is between the American League All-Stars and the National League All-Stars. We've got a real intriguing ball game today. The crew here at Baseball Tonight is set to bring it to you. It's time for baseball here on ESPN. Ahead, the American League All-Stars. Set to take on the NL All-Stars. Let's quickly check out tonight's hurlers. See who's got the edge. Jason Schmidt will take the ball for the NL All-Stars in this one. Look at the numbers from last year. That ERA, very respectable 3-2-0. Randy Johnson will take the hill for the American League All-Stars. What a fabulous year he had last season. Anytime your ERA is just about 2-6-0, oh, you're doing great, and that's where he was. And we are ready for baseball. John Miller and Joe Morgan have the call. They're live in Los Angeles. Fellas? Okay, Carl. And here's a good look at Dodger Stadium in Los Angeles, California, as we welcome you to a, another edition of Major League Baseball on ESPN. We are just moments away from the start of this year's All-Star Game. Tonight, it's the American League All-Star taking on the National League All-Star. Hello everyone, I'm John Miller, along with my longtime partner and Hall of Famer, Joe Morgan. Now, Joe, before we get down for the opening pitch of this ball game, well, what do you make of the American League All-Stars in this one? Well, Jason Giambi is the guy you always have to watch because he hits for a high average, he hits with power, and when you get runners in scoring position, he's one of the best hitters in the game. Uh, they'd better pitch him awfully careful tonight. Jason Schmidt will be doing the pitching. He had 18 wins for the club last year. But John Jason Schmidt is one of the elite pitchers in baseball. He can be overpowering at times. He has a great fastball. And he has an unbelievable changeup that he started to use more now. Has a great curveball and he has a great demeanor out there on the mound. Very tough to handle. I mean, this guy likes pitching in big games. The pregame warmups are over. It's about time for baseball. Thanks for joining us here on ESPN. First pitch on the way. Swung on, hit softly towards the hole. Pool hole is there to play it on the hole. And he'll step on first for out number one. Now the batting order for the American League. Jason Giambi is in the number four spot in the batting order. That's where the power hitters hit. Base is empty with one out. First pitch to him. Slider just misses. One ball, no strikes. Anytime the ball is breaking towards you and you hit the top of it, man, you might hit it off your shin. Be careful. This one swung on and hit in the air. Young is back to the warning track, but he makes the catch. Here's a quick look at the National League All-Stars in the field. Base is empty, two down. First pitch, here it comes. Started to go around, but it's in there for a called strike anyway. 0 and 1. The pitch. Oh, and he lays off the fastball. Good pitch. One ball, one strike. Well, he tried to throw it down and away, but it got away from him. The 1 1 pitch on the way. Swing and a miss on the slider, and it's 1 and 2. The one two pitch. This ball is hammered down the left field line but it goes foul. The one two pitch coming. Slider swung out of this. He struck it out and with that the side is retired. Here's a look back at the pitches leading up to the strikeout. It took him five to do it though. He's a tough at bat Joe. I, I, there's a lot of guys who are going to go away empty handed for the batter's box in this one. And they're held in check here in their half of the inning. Now we go to the last of the first and we have no score. The big unit Randy Johnson is going to be out there in the mound making the start in this one with a nice looking ERA just above 2.60. 
There's a swing and a ball hit very well down the left field line. And foul. Hit sharply towards the hole. A Rod is right there. And he is out at first. What a play. Nice play by the third baseman to keep his head down, then simply come up throwing. Here's the lineup for the National League. Albert Pujols. He'll be hitting third in that lineup. One out, nobody on. First pitch, here it comes. Swing and a fly ball down the left field line. John, this is a pretty good pitch to hit, and he gets good wood on it. Now he's in scoring position with one out. Now let's take a look at the defensive alignment of the American League All-Stars. One man out, one man on, a runner at second. First pitch on the swing and a liner to left. Ramirez is there and he puts it away. Ramirez has it and the runner will have to hold at second base. Joe Young is up now. He didn't have any home runs last season. With a career slugging percentage under 400. Two outs and a runner on second. First pitch to him. Fastball just misses. One ball, no strikes. Now he sets. Line shot into center field. Guerrero makes the catch and that ends the inning. We've got a second now to see the four seam fastball on K-Zone. As you can see, he's trying to get him to chase a pitch that's low in the zone, and he finally manages to get him to go for it. Yeah, that's a key out. Certainly was, but big time pitchers come through in tough situations like these. The National League All-Stars get no runs on one hit, and they leave a man at second. After one, then we have no score. The big hitters in the lineup right there in the middle coming up next. Jason Giambi will be the first man up. First pitch, here it comes. That one almost got the outside corner, but it's still down and away. Now the 1-0 pitch. The 1-1 pitch on the way. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. John, now they're really in business. A base hit with no one out. Guerrero will take his cuts here. First pitch on the way. Lined hard down the left field line. As this one, one hops off the wall. The throw to the plate. And this is how you want to start an inning. Back to back hits here have them in business with no one out. And it's going to be conference time on the mound John. It's time when everybody in the bullpen gets up shakes off the dust. And you'll never know how long he's going to stay with this pitcher now. Pudge Rodriguez comes in ready to hit. He had 19 homers last season, 86 RBIs last year. Nobody out and runners on second and third. Swing at a ground ball to short. And he throws on the first for the out, one away. Alfonso Soriano at the plate. This past season he had 28 home runs. In his career, his slugging percentage is 498. First pitch to him. Now a swing and a ball hit foul. The pitch. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. One run is in. The throw to the plate. John, he gets a pitch he can handle and he delivers the first run of the game here in inning number two. Now this is a perfect time for a hitter to try to take the pitch the other way. As you can see here, he does just that. That's smart baseball right there. Derek Jeter is the batter. Last season he knocked 23 out of the park. A career slugging percentage of 463. And he's back easily, but he made a dive just to make sure. Runners at first and third, only one out. 
First pitch, here it comes. First pitch, a slider for a called strike. Location is the most important thing for a breaking ball, and that one's perfect. Down. Here's a swing and a fly ball. Berkman is in his tracks as he puts this one away. The throw to the plate. And that will not be in time, so the run comes across to score. The big unit threw a perfect game last year in Atlanta at the age of 40. Two outs, a man on first. First pitch on the way. Swung on and missed. It's 0-1. Good hard slider swung on and missed. 0 and 2. Fastball swung on and missed, and with that, the side is retired. Let's see this one again on K-Zone. It was a four-seam fastball. You'll see this thing get tracked to the lower corner of the plate. It looked like the batter thought he had this one, but in the end, it was just too much for him to handle. Not the way he was looking to end that at bat, Joe. The AL All-Stars scored two on three hits, and they strand a man on base. On now to the last half of the second. A swing and a fly ball to left center field. And it's through and into the gap. It should be extra bases. The throw to second. Play at second, and he is safe as he's able to slide in. I like his swing on that double. This is how you get things started for a good inning. Now with no outs, he's in scoring position. John, he delivers a splitter on this one. Here it is on K-Zone. Ken gets his first look in this one. Runner at second with nobody out. First pitch to him. Fastball in there for a called strike. On the way. Swing and a miss on a ball off the inner edge. And it's 0-2. Man, he put everything into that swing. That one would have traveled a long way if he would have hit it. Got him on the splitter. One away. Great location on this pitch. He kept it down and caught the corner. Mike Piazza steps into the box. He finished up last year with 20 home runs. He's got a 557. Now here's a swing and a fly ball. And it's off the wall. The throw to the plate. John, nice job of getting the double. He took the fastball and ripped it. Good efficient swing right there. Runners at second and third with one out. Most of your power hitters like to extend their arms on that pitch away, but that one was too far away. John, this is what being at home. This one swung on and hit on a line, and it finds its way through into left field, a base hit. One run is in. Surprisingly, this guy usually doesn't hit well on that pitch, but he got his bat around on this one, and he's on base with a base hit. Two men on, one man out. First pitch on the way. Pitcher got two quick strikes. He's in rhythm here. Good focus from the pitcher. He deals. Fastball got him. Two down. Man, that's a tough pitch. All he could hope to do there is foul it off, but he swung right through it. Here's a replay of those last three pitches. Great pitches on the replay. Yeah, nice work, Joe. He didn't give him much to hit that time, that's for sure. Scott Rowland comes in. He had a total of 34 home runs last season. He's got a 520 career slugging percentage. A dive, but he's back in easily. First pitch to him. Hit in the air toward foul territory down the left field line. A throw back to second. Trying to keep him close, and he's back in time. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. And he'll be tagged out on a bonehead baseball play. 
done. Let's check out this slider on K-Zone. As you can see, he's trying to get him to chase a pitch that's low in the zone, and he finally manages to get him to go for it. Yeah, that's a key out. Certainly was, but big-time pitchers come through in tough situations like these. The NL All-Stars scored two runs on three base hits, but leave the bases empty. We'll go to the top of any number three, and we are all tied up. And the top of the order is coming up. Ichiro coming to the plate next, and he always guarantees a lot of trouble at the plate. Here's the 1-0 delivery. This one swung on and hit down the line and right. John, this is how you get things started leading off the inning. And he serves it up for a two-bagger. There's a runner at second. No outs yet. First pitch on the way. Now a swing of the ball hit well into right field. This one is really clobbered. Gone! A two-run homer. So, a tie ball game and then boom! The big fly, a streak of lightning across the sky, and they've got a two-run advantage. Well, sometimes guys like to look at a pitch, but not in this case. No, he uh, he had it in his mind that he was going to be aggressive. I think he, he thought he was going to get a fat one on that first pitch. He's locked in right from the get-go, and he takes this baby over the wall. And it looks like they're going to talk it over on the mound. I'm not sure if they're going to switch pitches here. We'll just have to wait and see what they decide. Manny Ramirez comes in here. Last season, he knocked out 43 home runs with a career slugging average of 599. Fastball swung on and missed 0 and 1. He kicks, he throws. Now here's a slow roller to third. And foul. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and he's down on strikes for the first down. Man, that's right down the middle. He missed it. Strike three. Three pitches, and he's out. Great pitching here. Let's take a look at the replay. Yeah, strike one, strike two, strike three, and see you later. Giambi will step in. One for one in this game. First pitch to him. Man, that's a great two-strike pitch, but it doesn't work here. Curveball down, starts in the strike zone, breaks down in the dirt. You'll get a lot of hitters to chase it. There's a swing and a ground ball. Pool holes. Has it, and he steps on first, and that's out number two. Nice play over there at first, just to keep that one for himself. Guerrero will step in, one for one in this game. First pitch on the way. Most pitching coaches will tell you if you're going to miss, miss low, not high. The 1 0 pitch on the way. This is swung on and hit in the air. And this one is into the alleyway and should be extra bases. Rodriguez will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Runner on second. Two down. Now a spin and a throw back to second. But he's back in time. Runner in scoring position at second base with two down. First pitch. Here it comes. Starts him out with a changeup for a strike. He kicks, he throws. There's a swing and a rocket toward short. Wilson is up with it. And he is out at first. What a play. The American League All-Stars pick up a couple here to break the tie. Now we'll go to the bottom of the third. The American League leads 4-2. to two. And they've got the 2-3-4 two, spots due up next. Lance Berkman will be coming up first. He's always dangerous. Had him reaching for that one. Strike one. Swing of the ball hit high in the air, deep to straightaway left field. That one is carrying well. Gone! A home run! Bertman destroyed that pitch. He's just a sensational hitter. And you can't ever mail in a pitch against him or he'll go deep. Now we'll get a chance to see the splitter on Kazo, John. I think this one just got away from him. He probably wasn't targeting that spot. But he left it out over the middle of the plate and the rest is history. Yeah, an historic home run. And uh, how do we know for sure? Because that soaring shot where Eagles dare will be on Sports Center later tonight. Check it out. Pool holes will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Nobody on base and no outs. Swing and a liner to left. And that falls for a base hit. The throw to second. I'll tell you what, there's a reason why that zone is colored red on his hit chart. 
There isn't a batter alive that wouldn't love to see pitches right down the middle every time he steps up. And it's going to be conference time on the mound, John. It's time when everybody in the bullpen gets up, shakes off the dust. And you'll never know how long he's going to stay with this pitcher now. Young, he's a switch hitter, and he's going to back from the right side here. Ground to the short, this could be two. On to second for one. From his knees, got him. What a play. He picked this one up nicely and then went around Cape Horn to get the double play. John, it's like infield practice, except this time they get two. Nice work to get the double play. Sosa will step in, one for one in this game. First pitch on the way. Well, they're setting up inside, but just missed off the inside corner. Well, the fans are giving him a huge ovation. There's a swing and a line drive to center field. Can't cut it off as it rolls all the way to the wall. Johnny really got a hold of that one and just scoots it by the infielders for a base hit. Kent will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. First pitch to him. Swung on and ripped towards second. The throw to third. Here's a guy that's at his most effective when he can extend those arms and take a big cut at the ball up in the zone like that. We've seen him do that before. That's where he likes it. Two down, runners at first and second. And he has to dive, but he's back in time. Two down, runners at first and second. First pitch, here it comes. There's a bullet towards third. A-Rod is there, and he throws on the first, and the side is retired. This was a big time tough situation and somehow he found a way to get out of the jam. Johnny's staring down one of the game's best hitters and he manages to get him out by working him upstairs. Just a nice bit of pitching. The National League All-Stars narrow the deficit a bit as they pick up a run on the homer. We're through three innings now. The American Leaguers lead it four to three. It's the last third of the batting order coming up. Alfonso Soriano will be the first man up. Swings and misses at that fastball. It's 0 and 1. Here's the pitch. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. The throw to second. The leadoff man is on, and they'll try to extend this lead a little bit. Jeter will bat here. He drove in a run earlier in this game. First pitch to him. Swings and lines this one back up the middle. And it's in there, base hit. The throw to third. Not the way you want to start the inning if you're on the mound. Two straight hits have them in business here with no one out. Johnson will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Runners on first and second. Nobody out. First pitch. Here it comes. Tough pitch for the hitter. You ball down and in. There's not a lot he can do with it. It's a great spot if you can get him to chase it. Ready with the 1-0 pick. Drops down a bunt. Over to second for one. Back to first and not in time. Not quite a double play that time. Ichiro gets a turn here. Last season he had eight home runs. His career slugging percentage is swings and lines this one towards the hole. Who holds? Has it and that'll hold the runners at the corners. Alex Rodriguez comes up to the plate here. Last year he had 36 home runs all year. His lifetime slugging average is at 574. When they get it in that location, sometimes you're better off just taking. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. Rowan has it, and they throw over the second for the force to retire the side. The American League All-Stars pick up no runs on two hits, and they strand just the one. On now to the last of the fourth, the American League leads it four to three. It's the number eight, nine, and one hitters coming up. Scott Rowland. Nice try. That pitch down and away, but the hitter was smart enough to lay off. Now the 1 0 pitch. Slider just misses the black, and he falls behind 2 0. The 2 0 pitch on the way. And here's a slider for a called strike 2 1. Well, that's a tough pitch. Ball moving up and in. It just got handcuffed. 
The two and one off. Swung on and ripped towards second. Soriano is over and he puts it away for the out. Zambrano will get his first shot from the batter's box in this game. Nobody on base with one out. Fastball swung on and missed 0 and 1. He throws. Good hard slider swung on and missed 0 and 2. Swing and a liner to left. And that falls for a base hit. Well, a little one out base hit here. Let's see if they can parlay this into something special. With one out, there's a runner at first. First pitch, here it comes. There's a swing and a line drive. As it will, in fact, as you see, go all the way to the wall. The throw to third. And he is safe at third. Just did slide in ahead of the play. And that's 10 hits now in the ball game for them. You have to wonder how much longer of a leash this pitcher's going to have. Berkman comes in now. He's a switch hitter batting from the right side. Runners at second and third with one out. First pitch to him. Starts him out with a fastball for a strike. This one swung on and fouled away. Fastball got him. Two down. Well, he was looking dead red. He got the fastball, but he could not make contact. Strike three. Let's take a look at the pitching sequence, John. He delivers three straight strikes. Yeah, that's not much of a sequence. Just uh, get to the plate and then take your spot in the bench. Albert Pujols gets a shot here. Last year, he had 46 home runs with a career 624 slugging. For on the ground to third and foul. On the ground to short. Jeter has got it. Throws the first in time for out number three. The NL All-Stars score once on two hits with one man left on. And we're through four full innings here at Dodger Stadium. And we are all tied. The numbers three, four, five spots, the big hitters do up. Manny Ramirez coming to the plate next, and he always guarantees a lot of trouble at the plate. Sliders in there, no balls and a strike. There's a swing and a ground ball. Oh, and it comes up on him. Roland has it. Here's another look at the error as he bobbles it. I thought he was going to come up with it, but it somehow got away from it. When you see Sports Center after the game, your error, it hurts, believe me. Giambi will step in. One for two in the ballgame. First pitch to him. And that swung on and missed. 0 and 1. This is swung on and lined softly toward center. And it's in there, base hit. They're starting this inning out in grand style. The base hit with no one out. Guerrero will come to the plate. Two for two in this one. First pitch, here it comes. Well, that's where you want to throw the sinker. Even if you miss, you want to keep it down. Now he sets. Here's the, here's the swing and a ground ball. And he boots it. And the throw is too late, so all hands are safe. It looked like he was going to come up with it, but he fumbled the catch. Yeah, just uh, the way you tried to get that uh, big uh, sailfish into the boat the other day. You're right about that. I didn't get it in. <laughs> and it looks like they're going to talk it over on the mound. I'm not sure if they're going to switch pitches here. We'll just have to wait and see what they decide. Pudge Rodriguez up there now. He had 19 homers last season. Swing and a ground ball to third. There's one. There's two. And they get the double play and decide not to go for three. Not this time. John, you know, I'm always talking about defense. I think you see a great example of it here. 
a terrific double play. A lot of things going on sometimes, and the timing is so key on plays like this. Great job. First pitch to him. Well, he was going for the big fly, but he comes up empty. Here it comes. This is just a wild pitch, John, and the manager's not happy. Well, it just got away from him. And the sinker is swung on and missed, and the side is retired. The American League All-Stars pick up no runs on one hit and they strand a couple. We go to the bottom of the fifth and we are all tied up. The heart of the order coming up next. Joe Young will be leading it off and they're going to have to deal with him somehow. First pitch, here it comes. Now a swing and he clobbers this one deep into right center field. Out of here, a home run. The solo home run, one swing of the back, breaks the tie ball game. That is a big home run in the clutch to give his team the lead. We got a second now to see the slider on Kazon. Now, Joe, that was a spectacular home run. Get out the tape measure for that one. Well, it was a pitch a little down and away. Not an easy pitch to take out of the ballpark, but he did just that. Sosa will come to the plate. Two for two in this one. The bases are empty. Nobody out. First pitch on the way. Well, most hitters aren't going to chase that pitch down and away because they can't hit it anyway. Well, he's got a chance to do something here. The fans are right behind him. And here's a fly ball to straightaway left. And he can't make the play. This could be trouble. The throw to second. Play at second, and he is safe as he's able to slide in. Johnny really got a hold of that one and just scoots it by the infielders for a base hit. Ken will step in. One for two in the ballgame. No outs, runner at second. First pitch to it. Swings and misses at that fastball. It's 0 and 1. He delivers. On the ground to third. The throw to third. Well, John, I tell you, with the vast majority of big leaguers at the plate, that's a great pitch. But this guy is one of those rare breeds that actually has success hitting that pitch down and in. First pitch, here it comes. He's at the belt. The one here's the swing of the fly ball hit medium deep. Might be enough to get him in. One run will score easily. Can't cut it off as it rolls all the way to the wall. Kent is right on his heels, and he will also score. John, nice job of getting the double. He took the fastball and ripped it. Good, efficient swing right there. Kazon will show us a look here at the four-seam fastball. I guess, John, they've decided that they want to at least talk it over on the mound. They're not quite sure if they're going to yank him, but it's anybody's guess right now. You have to figure they at least want to discuss what's going on right now, and we'll see how it turns out from here. Nobody out, the runner at second. First pitch on the way. And the pitch out with nothing doing that time. He's at the belt, the 1 0 pitch. And they pitch out, but nothing was going on there. Here's the 2 0 pitch. And that misses outside. Ball three. Now he's set. Here's the 3 0 pitch. John, this pitch had to be in the middle of the plate, not up and away. Zambrano will step in. One for one in this game. Runners on first and second. Nobody out. First pitch, here it comes. There's a bullet towards third. And he's in trouble as he's tagged out between first and second. And it turned into an easy double play. The base runner with a bonehead play. Well, you've got to get back, John, in that situation. Not great decision making there. Scott Rowland comes up to the plate now. He had a total of 34 home runs last season. 
He's got a 520 career slugging percentage. Swinging the ball hit pretty well heading into foul territory down the left field line. The pitch grounded softly to short. Jeter is up with it. His throw not in time and that'll be an infield single. Berkman will dig in now. Switch hitter who bats left handed. Two men on two men out. First pitch on the way. Fastball swung on and missed 0 and 1. Swings and lines this one back up the middle. Wilson is around third on his way home. Not in time with the plate as he's able to score easily. And he is at home as he just does get in there to score. This one you could dispute. It's hard to see if he got down in time, but the replay he really got to the plate just in time. It's hard to see with all that dust and all that excitement going on. And every once in a while, the umpires need night vision. First pitch to him, and he lays off the pitch outside and low for ball one. Ready with the 1-0 pitch. This swing and a drive down the left field line. It's towards the corner. And foul. Now he's set. Here's the 1-1 pitch. Slider just off the corner, and it's 2-1. and one. Here's the 2-1 pitch. Now a swing and a ball hit on the ground. Jeter is there. He'll throw on to first, and the side is retired. The NL All-Stars break the tie in a big way, putting a five spot on the board in this half of the inning. We're through five here at the ballpark. The National League is leading nine to four. And for the benefit of those of you who may have just tuned in, here's a reminder that I'm John Miller, along with Joe Morgan. He's the good-looking one. And we're bringing you Major League Baseball here on ESPN. They'll have the eight, nine, one spots coming up. Derek Jeter will be coming up in the next inning, and they'll have to deal with him somehow. And he swings and hits this one foul. There's a swing and a ground ball. Zambrano is there to play it on the hook. And his throw gets him. One away. Good reaction by the pitcher. He makes the play and throws on the first. One out. Nobody on. First pitch to him. Swing at a ground ball to short. Wilson is there. And he throws the first in time for out number two. Ichiro will come to bat now. He's one for three in the game. Base is empty. Two down here. First pitch. Here it comes. Swings and lines this one towards the hole. Two holes. On the run as he gets there in time to put it away. This is some big league ball right here, Joe. John, you want to see your entire defense working together, and that's what they did here. And they go quietly this half inning. Now we'll go to the last of the six. The National League on top, nine to four. The middle of the order, the four, five, six spots coming up next. Joe Young swinging a shot down the left field line. And foul. There's a swing and a drive down the line and left. It is carrying back there and foul. And here's a fly ball to straightaway left. Ramirez is there and he makes the catch. John, they get him out on his front foot a little and that causes him to swing under the ball and he lost it right to the left fielder. First pitch on the way. Fastball just misses. One ball, no strikes. Here's the 1-0 delivery. And he swings and hits this one foul. One ball, one strike to pitch. Good-looking fastball, but called a ball. Two and one. Here's the 2-1 pitch on the way. And that misses outside. Three and one. Well, he tried to get the outside corner, but he missed. Just barely. Smart hitter there. Now he's into his motion. Here's the three and one pitch. A lot of pitchers will throw their breaking ball even if they walk a guy, but they know they can't just throw it in the middle of the plate. Kent will bat here. He's two for three thus far. First pitch on the way. Just missed with the fastball. Ball one. And a throw over to first.
Now he sets. Here's the and this is hit in the air to straightaway left. Ramirez is right there as he puts it away. He swings under this one and the result is an easy out. Piazza will step in with a couple of RBIs already in this one. First pitch here it comes. Change up just misses one and oh. There he goes towards second. This one swung on and hit in the air. Ichiro puts it away and the side is retired. The NL All-Stars can't get anybody home here this happening. On to the seventh inning we go. The National Leaguers are out in front. Nine to four. The number two hole will be getting things started next. Alex Rodriguez, the most feared hitter in the lineup, set to lead it off. First pitch to him. First pitch is a sinker in there. It's 0 and 1. Pitch on the way. The 0 1 pitch, a fastball swung on and missed. 0 and 2. And man, that's 1 on 1 power baseball right there. Swing and a miss on the sinker. 1 away. That sinking fastball will get the job done every time. Nice pitch. Three pitches and he's out. Great pitching here. Let's take a look at the replay. Yeah, strike one, strike two, strike three, and see you later. Ramirez will step in. He's 0 for 3 up to this point. First pitch on the way. On the ground to short. Loretta has it on the hop. And a good throw gets him. Two down. Giambi will bat here. He's two for three thus far. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch, here it comes. Fastball misses away, ball one. The 1 0 pitch on the way. Had him out on the front foot that time as he evens up the count at 1 1. The 1 1 pitch on the way. Well, that's where you want to throw the sinker. Even if you miss, you want to keep it down. Here's the 2 1 pitch on the way. The 2 2 coming. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. Ken is right there. Throws the first and the side is retired. Well, they go down quietly. It's time to take a scratch here at Dodger Stadium. The National League leads 9 to 4. They'll have the 8 9 1 spots coming up. Scott Rowland. First pitch to him. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. Soriano has got it. They're starting this inning out in grand style. The base hit with no one out. Zambrano will step in. One for two in the ball game. First pitch on the way. Here's a curveball swung on and missed. It's 0-1. He deals. Big swing and a miss on the changeup. He struck him out. One away. He was looking for a fastball, John, but he got the changeup. Going right through it. Strike three. Rogers will be the new pitcher in the game. He was an 11 game winner last year. Well, it's no surprise they're turning to the bullpen here. The surprise is that they waited so long. They should have gone and got the start out of there a little earlier. One out, man on first. First pitch to him. Grounded a short, this could be two. Dives, and he's up with it. Over to first, and safe. Almost a double play, not quite on that time. He just did beat it out. He goes the short way to get the lead runner at second, but they're unable to get the back end. Berkman, he's a switch hitter, batting right-handed. Runner on first, two outs. Over to first. 
Two down, a runner at first. First pitch, here it comes. There's a swing and a liner to right center. Soriano has got it and the side is retired. No runs on a hit and one man left out. We'll move ahead to the eighth. The National League is leading nine to four. The five, six, seven spots do up. Vladimir Guerrero will try and cause some trouble leading off in the next inning. First pitch, here it comes. There's a swing and a rocket toward short. Loretta goes over and puts it away. Rodriguez will step in. He's 0 for 3 up to this point. One out, none on. First pitch on the way. Swings and misses at the sinker. 0 and 1. He kicks, he throws. Swing at a ground ball to short. Oh, and he bobbles this thing. Rowland is there. And he can't recover in time, so that will go as an error. Soriano will bat here. He drove in a run earlier in this game. First pitch to him. Hit in the air toward foul territory down the left field line. Now that he's ahead 0 and 2. He's got a few pitches he can play with. He'll try to get him to chase something out of the zone. Here's a swing and a fly ball. Berkman roams over and puts it away for the out. The center fielder has to range to his left, but he's able to track it down over there and put it away. Jeter will step in. One for two in the ball game. First pitch, here it comes. Here's another look at the wild pitch, John. I know he wishes he had this one back. Well, I don't know if he just tried to snap it off a little too hard, held a little bit too long. Whatever, he's given up uh, an extra base there. He's at the belt. The one. This one swung on and hit in the air. Over the wall. Two runs in on the home run. Now they still trail by three runs, but that two run homer makes it uh, look a little bit more doable. Here's the four seam fastball coming at you on K zone to give you a better look. I'm pretty sure, yep, he was going for the bottom of the zone with that pitch, but he just didn't get it down enough. As a result, this one's headed over the wall. Not a bad pitch, though, Joe. It looked like he got a real good swing on it. Yeah, he got a little muscle behind this one and it carried out of the ballpark for him. I guess if the guy hits it 400 feet, though, it's, it's not a good Not a pitch. good pitch. Sheets, he'll be coming into the game to take over the mound duties. He won 16 games last year. He's held the opposition down very effectively. They've hit only 225 against him. And they wanted the percentages on their side, so they went out and got the righty from the pin. That's good managing. First pitch on the way. And he swings and lines this one softly to right. And it drops in for a base hit. And they will tag him out near the bag at first. The American League All-Stars strike for a couple to draw a bit closer. Here comes the National League in the home half of the eighth. The National Leaguers are out in front. Nine to six. The numbers three, four, five spots in the order is coming up next. Todd Helton is due up next, and you always have to be careful with him. Fastball just misses. One ball, no strikes. Now the 1-0 pitch. This is swung on and hit on the ground. Giambi is right there. And he'll step on first for out number one. Great job here by the first baseman with the force out. That's a nice, simple defensive play. One out, nobody on. First pitch, here it comes. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. Giambi is there to play it on the hop. Throws in time to first. What a play. Matt Lawton steps up to the plate. He finished up last year with 20 home runs. He knocked home 70 a year ago. First pitch on the way. Now a swing and a ball hit foul. He delivers. Now here's a swing and a ball hit on the ground. Jeter is up with it. Throws on to first in time to retire the side. It was a close play at first. This is a little too close for comfort. You see that last little stretch, but he's called out. Close play. And they're gone in short order here with through eight ninth inning coming up. The National League leads it nine to six. Top of the lineup coming up next. Ichiro will be the first man up. 
First pitch to him. First pitch is that palm ball, and it's in there, 0 and 1. John, the way he gripped the pitch dictates where it's going to end up. Hit in the air to center field. And that one falls in there, base hit. This is just what they needed. They get a base hit to kick off the inning. Now they will need to string together a couple of more hits to get him home. Runner at first, nobody out. First pitch, here it comes. There's a swing and a drive deep into left center field. Oh, and it's off the wall. The throw to the plate. John has two straight hits here to start the inning. And that's exactly the way you want to start it here when you're trailing late in the ballgame. Two men in scoring position and nobody out. Not many people can handle that fastball up and away. The 0 1 pitch is a fastball inside to even the count at 1 and 1. Now the 1 1 pitch, here it is. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. Over the first, four out number one. Jason Giambi steps up. He finished last season with 12 home runs. His career slugging percentage is at 540. Swing and a miss, although he looked to be right on it. The pitch. Got the curve by him that time, and he's in control, 0-2. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the second out of the inning. John, that's right at the knees. Great location with two strikes. Fooled him completely. John, let's check out this four-seam fastball. Here's Kazon. And Joe, the manager is not going to be too happy. And not a great swing here, but even the best hitters get fooled from time to time. First pitch to him. Swing at a high drive down the left field line. And foul. Swing at a high drive, straight away left field, racing back to the wall. Tell it goodbye, a three-run homer. They were down by three a moment ago, but he has tied it up. It's a brand new game as a result of his three-run homer. I thought this one might just hit the wall, John, but he had just enough carry on it, and the pitcher thought he was going to hit the wall as well. It reminded me of Big Mac's 62nd home run in 98, just a liner, just barely made it over. Well, left fielder thought he had a chance. He was patting his glove and hoping to get a shot at it, but no luck. Pudge Rodriguez up there now. He had 19 homers last season. He's got a career slugging percentage of 490. First pitch, here it comes. Now here's a swing and a fly ball. Young is there and he puts it away for out number three. The AL All-Stars come up with three runs here and have drawn even. And we move on to the last of the ninth, and we're all tied. The six, seven, eight hitters are coming up next. Jeff Kent, the most feared hitter in the lineup, set to lead it off. First pitch on the way. Change up, just misses. 1-0. and Here's the 1-0 delivery. There's a swing and a bullet towards the hole. A-Rod lays out and makes a spectacular catch. A-Rod with an acrobatic diving grab of big league play. Well, this is why I never liked playing third base growing up. It can be like a shooting gallery down there, the way balls rocket at you. But he reacts quickly and spears this line drive. First pitch. There's a swing and a ground ball. Giambi has got it. And the throws in time at first. And oh, man, what a play. I like the nice execution here by the first baseman, and he gets the force out. Loretta will step in one for one in this game. Base is empty, two down here. First pitch to him. And this one's wide. Now let's see if they're going to walk him intentionally here. Well, the crowd is backing up here. Let's see if we can do anything. Score still tied. The 2 0 pitch on the way. The 3 0 pitch. Pitch out, but nothing doing that time. 
John, this pitch had to be in the middle of the plate, not up and away. Two outs, a man on first. They throw over to first. A dive, but he's back in easily. Runner on first, two outs. First pitch, here it comes. Ready with the 1-0 pitch. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. And that's a base hit as it gets down in front of him. The throw to the plate. Boy, John, what an A-B. He makes it look easy here with this swing. But coming off the bench cold is one of the toughest things to do in all of baseball. Rivera is going to become the new pitcher in the game. Well, it's not a save situation, but they don't want to let this game get away from them. So they'll turn to the closer here in the ninth anyway. First pitch on the way. Swings and misses at the good change. It's 0-1. Here's the pitch. Swing and a roller towards the hole. A-Rod has got it. Throws the first in time for out number three. The National League All-Stars pick up no runs on a hit and leave two men on. A little extra baseball today. We head to the 10, and this game is tied. It's the bottom three of the batting order coming up. Alfonso Soriano will be leading it off, and they're going to have to deal with him somehow. Fastball runs inside, 1-0. Now the 1-0 pitch. Hit in the air to left center. As it will in fact as you see go all the way to the wall. John the move to get a righty from the pin to face him backfired. He comes through here with a good swing. First pitch. This is swung on and hit in the air. Young is right there as he puts it away. Young has it and the runner will have to hold at second base. This one's hit pretty well but it stays in the park and the left fielder is able to range back and put it away. One man out one man on a runner at second. First pitch on the way. And he's in there at third. This isn't even close. He's got this thing measured all the way and they have no shot at him at third base. I like this deal, John. He had a good lead off second, and he dives into third base and beats the throw. Well, you're one of the great base dealers of all time, Joe, so if you like it, I definitely like it. I like it. Now he sets. Here's the here's a swing and a liner into left center. And that gets down for a base hit. And that'll bring a run home. And talk about a clutch at bat here in extra frames. Nothing like putting the pressure on here in the top half and daring the home team to come back. One on, one out. First pitch to him. Slider in there for a called strike. He kicks, he throws. Swung on and lined to right field. Lawton boots it. John, I thought he had this one, but he couldn't control it, and it gets away from him. Well, that is tough, because that looks like a sure out. And you hate to have an error on a play like that. A-Rod will be next. He's had two hits in five. Now a swing of the ball hit well into right field. It's got some carry to it. At the wall, and he makes the catch. He brought one back into the ballpark. Incredible play. The throw to the plate. They wisely backed up those outfielders before the play. So he was right there to put this thing away. Great coaching. Lawton went all the way up and brought this one back into the yard. Here's a look. Well, this is a great individual effort. Ball is carried farther than I thought it would. He's got to contend with the wall, but he stretches himself out, and that ball hits his glove right in the pocket. Quick reflexes there allowed him to get out of the way. He's at the belt. Big swing and a drive. High in the air. And it's off the wall. The throw to third. And that's just a little insurance for them there. As now they have a little breathing room for the bottom of the night. Jason Giambi steps in. 
He finished last season with 12 home runs. His career slugging percentage is at 540. He swings and misses at the splitter 0 and 1. He throws. Swing and a liner to right. And that falls for a base hit. The throw to the plate. Johnny's having a great day here. Three hits for him in this one. They just can't get him out. Hudson will be brought into the game now to pitch. Good decision here to play the percentages and bring in the left-handed reliever. That's good fundamentally sound baseball. Vladimir Guerrero comes to the plate. He went yard 39 times a year ago. And he's got a 589 career slugging percentage. Took something off and it swung on and missed. Strike one. Now here's the ball hit very well. Soaring into deep center field. Gone! A three-run big fly. And Joe with this three-run homer, suddenly that lead has doubled. They're up by six. Now there are not a lot of guys that can hit a ball like that. Straight away center field and get it out of here in a hurry. Yeah, the only guy who was going to catch that one was some guy in the bleachers. <laughs> well, we'll see that one again on Sports Center tonight. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch on the way. There's a swing and a pop up. And foul. And this is hit in the air to straightaway left. Young is there and he makes the catch to retire the side. The American League All-Stars put some distance between them and their opponents with a big inning here. Now it's on to the last of the 10th. The American League's on top 15 to 9. The number two hole will be getting things started next. Lance Berkman coming to the plate next and he always guarantees a lot of trouble at the plate. This one swung on and fouled away. Well he's getting some encouragement here from the crowd. It's nice to see the fans are still paying attention. In the air to deep right and foul. Here's the pitch. Swings and lines this one towards the hole, but he stays with it and gets the out. Nice recovery. Helton will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. One out, nobody on. First pitch to him. There's a swing and the ball hit well down the line. This one has a chance. And foul. Ooh, and he lays off the fastball. Good pitch. One ball, one strike. The 1 1 pitch on the way. Good looking fastball, but called a ball. 2 and 1. The 2 and 1 pitch on the way. And he fouls this one off. Here's the 2 2 pitch. Now a swing and a ball hit foul. 2-2 two, two pitch on the way. That swung on and a high fly ball to right. Ichiro is right there and he puts it away. Not a bad swing but he's too far underneath it. And the result is an easy fly to right. Two outs nobody on. First pitch here it comes. That ball is lifted high in the air, deep down the line and right. Gone, a solo homer. The catcher sets up inside, but this is a guy that can handle that pitch inside. And he puts a good swing on this one. Well, John, we can't head out to the parking lot just yet. The hometown boys still have some fight left in them. Yeah, we thought it was all over, but now they're making some noise here as if they have some uh, intent on getting back into this one. Now if they can just string a couple of more hits together, they'll be knocking on the door. Lawton will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Bases empty, two down. First pitch on the way. Great location with the cutter. If you keep it there, you can get everybody out. And he delivers. Good hard slider that time, and he's in control 0 2. 
Ooh, that's a big fly swing right there. Swung on and missed, and the ball game is over. The American League All-Star win this one in dramatic fashion. Well, I love games like this, John. I mean, this game was exciting from the first hit to the very last hit. I mean, the fans got their money's worth tonight. Vladimir Guerrero was one of the many heroes of this one at the plate, and he's our ESPN Video Games Player of the Game. Well, Vlad did it again, John. I don't think this guy has a weakness at the plate. I mean, he will crush anything you throw him. You've seen him do this before. You saw him in this game, and you'll be seeing more of him in years to come. So that's it for tonight, folks. And Joe, it's been a great night of baseball, a long night, but a very profitable night for us who enjoy the thrills of Major League Baseball. Now for Joe Morton. This is John Miller. Thanks for tuning in. We hope you enjoyed the game. Now, good night. Once again, our final in 10 innings. The National League wins it 15 to 10. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports. For more, log on to ESPN.com. So long from Southern California.